What's going on everybody? Spunky Nice Not One coming you guys with another video. So um defensive tackle um uh, Timmy Jernigan recently spoke about um you know being focused on the future, his future here with the Eagles, uh, putting everything that's happened in the past in the past and you know not not thinking about um the 2018 season, which was obviously a rough season for him. He spent most of it um on injury reserve, then came back late in the season. Um <clears throat> obviously got cut this offseason and the Eagles bought him back for a much cheaper um you know much much cheaper uh payday you know um a, a, a much cheaper contract but he came back you know he, he he loves this team he loves the locker room and he just he and he talked about how he just wants to um do his part to help this team win and uh I'm gonna read to you guys exactly what Timmy Jernigan has said and of course I'm gonna give you my thoughts afterwards so let me go ahead and get started here uh here's what um Timmy Jernigan had to say. He said that I'm motivated to win games and help this team. I feel like last year, I feel like la I feel like last year that that's in the past. Man, I can't change that. I'm just focused on what's ahead of me. I'd rather not look back on that situation. It is what it is. It's over. My focus is on what's going on now. I'm just excited about what we got going on here right now. So very short and simple. Timmy Jernigan, you know, being very, um, you know, just being very uh, honest and um, to the point. You know, he, he's not fo he's not uh, thinking about last season. You know, last season, like I said, was a, you know, rough season, obviously, for him. You know, be, you know, um, spent, spent most of the year on um, reserve, whatever, and uh, he came back late in the season. He had just the, the prior year, obviously, the Eagles draft, um, not drafted, they traded, um, they traded um, with the Baltimore Ravens for him. Uh, he was brought in to be a complimentary piece next to um, uh, Fletcher Cox, and he and he was that 2017 season. He definitely had flashes of greatness, man, and he earned this, he earned himself a, bit, a very big contract with the Eagles. But um, you know, the, the all last season, man, it was just a complete mess. You know, um, his you know his his um his status was just a mess last year, and ultimately the Eagles decided that it was not worth paying him that type of money to um to keep him on that con you know, to keep him on that contract. So they released him, and they brought him back on a much cheaper deal. And I think that says a lot about Timmy Jernigan and his um, his character and what's important to him. Man, money is not a, is not as important to him. He's more he he loves the locker room. He uh, he he cares about winning, and that's what I love in our locker room, man. I love that we have these group of guys in our locker room who put the team over themselves. That is a rarity in the NFL to have players who. Um, who are, who are about who are more about the team than they are their individual selves. Um, you know, he, he could have made more money elsewhere for sure. There would have been teams I think definitely would have paid Timmy Jernigan a little bit more than what he made with the Eagles. You know, they, what he made what he's making with the Eagles this year. But for him, man, you know the brotherhood, the bond of that locker room, that is what you no, know, that's what um, brought him back, man. He, that's what made him, that's what had him agree to take that take much less money to come back. That's what convinced him, you know, was, was the brotherhood, you know, just loving Philadelphia, man. He, he's he's embraced the city of Philadelphia, and I think overall Eagle fans have, have embraced him. Uh, I'm I'm very happy that we brought Timmy Jernigan it back, you know. Obviously, this, you know, he's gonna be he's gonna be um, a rotational piece now. Um, Elite Jackson, obviously, the Eagles signed him in free agency, so that puts Timmy Jernigan more likely as the third. Um, defensive tackle, and then number four, you got Hassan Ridgeway. Of course, Fletcher Cox, number one, defensive tackle. So yeah, with the addition of um, um, Malik Jackson, that pushes him, that pushes him down to the number um, three spot. But I do expect him to get a lot of playing time. I, you know, we we do a lot of rotations at on that defensive line, so uh, his playing time will dip, obviously. But I do expect him to get a lot of playing time, and I hope he goes out there, man, and absolutely lights it up you know, and takes advantage of his opportunities. Because I would love to see Timmy Jernigan um, remain in Philadelphia after this season. I like the guy a lot, man. Um, you know, it, it sucked the way last year went, you know, um, with the injury and stuff. But I'm glad that the Eagles, um, they, they were able to work something out with him and his agent. It was a lot less money, I'm, I'm, but I'm glad they were able to work it out and um, bring him back to Philadelphia. And like I said, man, the fact that he took less money to, to come back to Philadelphia when he could have made more money elsewhere says a lot about his character, man. It says a lot about um, what's important to him as a play, as a person, a player. Uh, he 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 cares more about winning than he does money, and you know that's a rarity in the NFL. It's, it truly is a rarity to find guys who are more about the team than they are about 
you know, the, the, the money. So I'm very happy to have Timmy back, man. Um, I'm very happy to have Timmy back, and I hope Timmy goes out there and absolutely lights it up um, next season. But, but yeah, but yeah, he made it very clear. He was very honest. He was very to the point. Uh, he, he he's not thinking about 2018. You know what happened in 2018 is it is in 2018. That that's the past. You know you can't go back and change what happened there, man. You gotta move on to the future, and that's what Timmy is doing. He's moving on and focusing on the future and doing whatever he can to help bring this team another Labardi Trophy. You know, so I'm 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 very excited to have Timmy back. But um yeah. You guys let me know anything in the comment section. Um, you know, are you very happy to have Timmy back at, like I am as well? Let me know anything in the comment section. Um, but as always, go birds. Spunky991 is out of here. Fly, eagle, fly. Peace.